Hey guys, it's Doug with Vicaros. We're here to show you how to calibrate the compass on your Atlas Edge or Atlas II. This is a super, super important step to take to make sure that you're taking full advantage of a really, really accurate compass. Compasses can be thrown out of calibration by a number of things from being too close to a big magnet, like your car speakers, your phone speakers, anything on the boat that might be ferrous. And so what I like to do and what we always recommend is calibrate my compass before every regatta. The process is quick, it's simple, it's easy, and it starts with having your Atlas and your phone with the Vicaris Connect app. So the first thing I'm gonna do is open the Connect app and I'm gonna go to the Devices menu. Once I'm in the Devices menu, I'm gonna click on the device that I wanna calibrate. In this case, it's called Doug's Edge. I'm gonna scroll down and I'm gonna see Compass Calibration as an option under Settings. I'm gonna hit that button. It's gonna show me some options. So first it's gonna tell me to prepare and that's gonna tell me to get away from metal objects. It's gonna tell me to find an open spot. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and take my watch off. If I were wearing any jewelry, I would get rid of that. I'm just gonna to toss it over next to me. We'll hit next and it's gonna give me some instructions on the calibration process. You're gonna to wanna to start the process, set your phone down, walk away. The Atlas will tell you what to do and will show you also in this video. It's gonna show you a few different types of rotations you can do, or you can use what we call the gyro technique and just rotate it around in sort of a figure eight pattern. We'll show you how to do that. Now we'll get to step six, calibrate, and we're gonna hit begin calibration. Once I do that, my phone and the Atlas both start counting down. So I'm gonna set my phone down and step away. Here we are. This is the gyro technique that we're talking about sort of rotating it in a figure eight pattern. You can also do axial rotations as well, if you're more comfortable with that. Just getting a lot of great data and keeping the Atlas in one place. Now that it's done, calibration's complete and I can return to my phone. I'm gonna pick up my phone. My device is gonna restart with the new calibration applied and my compass is gonna be working just as well as it did coming out of the factory.